Hey guys, Emily here. So I thought to start this off in my room really fast. So spur of the moment, I'm going to SpaCon. Only for today though. Uh, my friend works at the mall, so I'm gonna take the bus. Probably go to the SpaCon. Um, I'm not dressing up, as you can tell. I'm going to be my photographer self today and promote like crazy to try to get some shoots because next week is Consplosion and I like to do some more advertisement before Consplosion so hopefully today's a good day. I'll be vlogging throughout the day or try to at least. I know I'm meeting up with some friends I haven't seen in a while so it's going to be a really great relaxing day. First time in a long time that I went to a con not dressed up so it'll be really fun but I'll do check-ins with you guys later. Okay, so like I told you guys, I'm at SpaCon today. I'm doing, I'm being a photographer, but look who I found! <laughs> it's been forever since I've last seen her. I think the last time I saw you was at, I can't believe I'm going to say this, ACA. Yeah, it was. That was the last time April. I saw you. In April. It was April. It's too long. It was. But at least now that you're closer, yes. hang out more. Yeah, I mentioned in another vlog, which I haven't uploaded yet, that I moved. So I moved a lot closer to everybody now. Oh, yeah. So it's a lot fun, and we still keep adding cost plans. Yeah, I, that, but, it's a never-ending list, literally. Yeah. But it's kind of funny because last year we said, "Yeah, we'll go to Spalcon next year." Um, I didn't think I was going because of moving, but my friends like, "Hey, I can drop you off." I'm <laughs> like, "Why not?" Yeah, I'm tagged her on a post on my Instagram at midnight, and then she messaged me, "Hey." <laughs> like, hey. Well, because I was still up at 5 o'clock this morning sewing this on and this dress. I'll upload a photo um, right next on me, I guess. I'll put it on <laughs> me. But her outfit looks amazing. I did not make this, though. This is the only thing I didn't make. I actually sewed it. But the, you found that, though. Yeah, I what? found it at the Goodwill Bins on Scott Hamilton in Little Rock. And I don't even know how much we paid for it, but it was like next to nothing. And it had the clasp, and it actually has a button sewn back here to help hold it on better, too. So I'm excited because I get to see all my friends again. Yep. Um, I get to meet a couple of cosplayers I did not get to meet last year. <laughs> and I get to move around a lot more now since I'm dressed normal. <laughs> Normie. It's weird not wearing a, it's weird not wearing a costume. I try to do simple makeup as you and can And not tell. wearing a brace. Yeah, and not wearing a brace. It feels amazing. Yeah, that was the other problem was, or the other issues yeah. you were having was you were wearing braces. Yeah, wearing or braces brace constantly. Name. But I try to wear some geeky stuff. I'm wearing my Naruto accessories, my Star Wars shirt, and <laughs> she got me a pin. This is Hey Hey. Because if you didn't know, Hey Hey's my spirit animal. Who was yours again? The little kid that like was like, mm, Hey Moana. I, I will, love that little kid. I will post a photo <laughs> of her. Her spirit animal will be right here, and mine will be right here. <laughs> yeah, but um, oh, I'll probably yeah. get her more on camera later because I'll be vlogging throughout the day. Because I'm taking photos on my camera and I have my camcorder but I really don't want to set it up and it's just easier to edit on my cell phone right now until I get internet later and then I'll do my camera but iPhones are really great for vlogging on. <laughs> She's one of us now. Yeah, I, I joined the <laughs> iPhone part. Dark side. Yeah. <laughs> iPhone dark side. Yeah, but it's nice. Um, SpotCon looks a little bit different this year. Um, yeah, the main events is now at the other end where it was at this end last yeah. year. I'll get some clips on my phone, but it's um I think the vendors is a lot bigger. Yeah, it's or a lot they're just bigger. set up different. They look bigger, maybe. Yeah, probably. I know we have I have a few friends who are doing vendors, and then a few are doing artists. A lot of people I know are here. <laughs> it's gonna be fun, but I'll do check-ins later. But I just had to show we're back <laughs> with vengeance. We're back. <laughs> Oh, yes. But all right, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Bye. Bye. Hey, guys. So, I met up with a couple of friends of mine. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to say your guys' cosplay name? Yes. We are Web of Arnock, And we are cosplaying Spider Gwen. And I'm Spider Man. Yeah, as, as you can tell, I'm Spider Man, you know. Classic. Very classic. Like a spider queen. <laughs> I just got done doing a photo shoot for them. Like I told you guys, I'm doing photo shoots this con. It's weird not cosplaying because I always see them when I'm in different costumes. I think at A2F, I was in a few different ones every time I saw you guys. Like, you're going to stay in one costume or are you going to keep changing? <laughs> but I'm happy I got to see them here today. 
I'm going to be seeing them next weekend at Consplosion. Absolutely. And you'll probably see them more on there too. And they also have a YouTube channel as well, mm -hmm. which I will link down below as well. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Yes. Thank you for watching. I love seeing you guys. Yes. It's like follow Emma. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Thank you. But I will see you guys in a few minutes to find other people too. But I just wanted to get them on here. These are like my favorite people ever to see at cons. I see them every single time, so I'm really, really happy. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Bye. Okay, it's about the end of con time. I'm just sitting right now and relaxing because I'm, I'm tired, I'm beat. And I have a giant box, sound box, when I get home. And I'd like to say a shout out to Jade Grayish Cosplay because Jade got me a crap ton of makeup. Like, no joke. So I can't wait to see everybody at Consplosion next weekend. I'm excited and nervous since I have new costumes coming out. By the time this video is uploaded, it will be Consplosion. So I will be vlogging at Consplosion as well. So I can't wait to see everybody. And I also got some photo shoots. So I can't wait to edit those and have those uploaded. I have to wait till we get to the Con, um, Consplosion Hotel to upload everything, but you guys will probably see previews on my photography Instagram, which I'll have a link right there and down below. So I'll do an unboxing video when I get home. Bye. It's at the end of the night, like I was telling you guys earlier. I'm getting so, in here. <laughs> yeah, look at her. I'll post a full photo of her in a few minutes. Oh God, I'm like shiny. Wow, that's what you know you had a long day. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh my God. I sure you know you had a long day. I get thirsty girl um, here. She loves me. Let's let's just open it. Like I'll do an um, actual unboxing later, but um And swatches. Yes, look at this. Like like, like <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I showed Nightingale. Yeah. Because she was curious. I was like, yeah, this is just all makeup. She's like, your friend gave you that? I'm like, yup. <laughs> Oh hi! Hello! Awesome. Uh, are you going to Holocaust? Yes. I'll see you at Holocaust. Let's get loose. the rave. Me. Bye. Bye. Do you want to say hi? Uh, two more guys. That's one way to say hi. <laughs> hey guys, so I never really ended my vlog from last night from SpaCon, so I'm doing a quick um, unboxing really fast. So all of this is from Jaden Creations Cosplay, like um, I believe she told you in the video too. But okay, except these and these and that. I threw stuff in it real fast. But anyway, um, I'm going to go through it real fast with you guys before I put it up in my makeup collection because I'm going through my entire collection right now. But anyway, she gave me, there was three pairs, but I took one pair and put in my pack of lashes I take with me to all my cons. So these are the Kick Some Lash. And I've actually had these before. She gave me the first two. That's the reason why it's cut right there. And I actually really like this brand. And then she gave me her... Mannerisms, I think that's how you say it. Okay. Um, fa folks, mink slashes. I can never say that word right. Let me try to open this one handed. Me. Okay. I think she said, oh, ignore right now. I think she said she didn't like these because they were doubled. But I like them. I'm, gonna try, I'm probably going to wear these this weekend. And these are the House of Lashes. Here, let me fix this real fast for you guys. Okay. So these are the House of Lashes. And I'm really excited because I've heard nothing but good things about this brand. And the only thing that irritates me is these are the exact same lashes I wore at Arkansas Anime Festival. And I got them for $2.00. At Walmart but you know what these are free and the house lashes so maybe they won't break like the other pair did okay so 
There's a lot of stuff in here. Now, the reason why she gave me a lot of the stuff is because, one, she was going through her collection. Two, almost every single thing in here she, it has never been really used. Maybe she swatched them. And... And, um... Use them once or twice, which is fine. So, okay. Oh, yeah. That's not hers either. Okay. So. Oh, and a lot of these she got from Beauty Boxes, too, which is which most of these are from. So, okay. I got to put these in my bag of brushes anyway. So, these are the Luxie brand, which I am obsessed with them. I only have... Well, now I have a few pairs, but the first pair I have is drying right now because I washed my brushes earlier. So, I got a Luxie E5, E516 Dual Fiber Powder. And then, oh, these are like the softest brushes ever. And this one is a Luxie 522 Tampered Highlighter Brush. Ooh. Yeah, that's soft. And this one is a Luxie 660 Precision Foundation Brush, which I'm probably not going to use it for foundation. I don't like using brushes for foundation. And this one is a Anesthetic P12. Oh, that's so soft. I'll probably use this as a powder brush. And then there's one more in here. This is Burma? Huh. Ooh, that's really soft. Okay, so. And there's like some beauty stuff in here too. Which I'll just probably put to the side. Oh, I didn't see this one. Is this one too? Okay, there's two more. So we got another Aesthetica. It's like a liner brush. You can use that for lip liner too. Ooh, and an angle brush. Same brand. I love angle brushes a lot. Okay. So she gave me this because she knew I, she knows I love cleaning my makeup brushes, which I want to try these, so I can't wait to try this. Should have used it earlier, but forgot. Okay, so some of these are like the sample packs you get in like birch boxes or yeah, it's mostly birch boxes. Which I'm okay with it because I love trying trying new stuff. Okay, let's see. This is a color gloss. There's like a lot of lipsticks. I probably won't go through every single one. Yeah, I got the 24 hour stay. This is a new e.l.f. collection, which I'm excited to try that out. And brow um, mascara, brow stuff, which I'm excited to try out. Ooh, you know, I'm gonna put you on my tripod. So it's easier for me to talk to you guys. <laughs> hey guys, so I never really ended my vlog from last night from SpaCon. So I'm doing a quick um, unboxing really fast. So all of this is from Jaden Creations Cosplay. Like, um, I believe she told you in the video too. But okay, except these and these and that. I threw stuff in it real fast. But anyway, um, I'm going to go through it real fast with you guys before I put it up in my makeup collection. Because I'm going through my entire collection right now. But anyway, she gave me... There was three pairs, but I took one pair and put in my pack of lashes I take with me to all my cons. So these are the Kick Some Lash. And I've actually had these before. She gave me the first two. That's the reason why it's cut right there. And I actually really like this brand. And then she gave me her... Mannerisms, I think that's how you say it. Okay. Um, fo folks, mink slashes. I can never say that word right. Let me try to open this one handed. Me. Okay. I think she said, oh, ignore my nail. I think she said she didn't like these because they were doubled. But I like them. I'm, gonna try, I'm probably going to wear these this weekend. And these are the House of Lashes. Here, let me fix this real fast for you guys. Okay. So these are the House of Lashes. 
And I'm really excited because I've heard nothing but good things about this brand. And the only thing that irritates me is these are the exact same lashes I wore at Arkansas Anime Festival. And I got them for $2 at Walmart. But you know what? These are free. And they're house lashes, so maybe they won't break like the other pair did. Okay, so. There's a lot of stuff in here. Now, the reason why she gave me a lot of the stuff is because, one, she was going through her collection. Two, almost every single thing in here she, it has never been really used. Maybe she swatched them. And... And, um... Use them once or twice, which is fine. So, okay. Oh, yeah. That's not hers either. Okay, so. Oh, and a lot of these she got from Beauty Boxes, too, which is which most of these are from. So, okay. I gotta put these in my bag of brushes anyway. So, these are the Luxie brand, which I am obsessed with them. I only have... Well, now I have a few pairs, but the first pair I have is drying right now because I washed my brushes earlier. So, I got a Luxie e -Fit E516 Dual Fiber Powder. And then, oh, these are like the softest brushes ever. And this one is a Luxie 522 Tampered Highlighter Brush. Ooh. Yeah, that's soft. And this one is a Luxie 660 Precision Foundation Brush, which I'm probably not going to use it for foundation. I don't like using brushes for foundation. And this one is a Anesthetic P12. Oh, that's so soft. I'll probably use this as a powder brush. And then there's one more in here. This is Burma? Huh. Ooh, that's really soft. Okay, so. And there's like some beauty stuff in here too. Which I'll just probably put to the side. Oh, I didn't see this one. Is this one too? Okay, there's two more. So we got another Aesthetica. It's like a liner brush. You can use that for lip liner too. Ooh, and an angle brush. Same brand. I love angle brushes a lot. Okay. So she gave me this because she knew I, she knows I love cleaning my makeup brushes, which I want to try these, so I can't wait to try this. Should have used it earlier, but forgot. Okay, so some of these are like the sample packs you get in like birch boxes or yeah, it's mostly birch boxes. Which I'm okay with it because I love trying trying new stuff. Okay, let's see. This is a color gloss. There's like a lot of lipsticks. I probably won't go through every single one. Yeah, I got the 24 hour stay. This is a new e.l.f. collection, which I'm excited to try that out. And brow um, mascara, brow stuff, which I'm excited to try out. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. you know I'm Hey guys, so I'm editing my video, or finished editing my video for SpaCon, and I want to say that I forgot to get some clips, so I'm going to add photos at the end of the guests that I met, and sorry if I sound horrible, it's some kind of, it's 11, 10 a.m., I work at 12, so I'm tired, but anyway, I'm going to add photos at the end of the video so you guys can see some of the guests. And I'll have all their links down below, like usual. But I gotta say, SpaCon was a blast this year. Even if I didn't get to cosplay and I only went one day, I'm so thankful that I got to go. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you guys like the more videos I have coming out. Because I am officially back on YouTube. I will be uploading more. So if you guys don't want to miss any videos... Please hit that subscribe button and please hit that bell because, you know, YouTube being YouTube, so notifications have been messing up. I have noticed it, but they're, they're probably fixing it. You know, you never know. So anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.